I'm gonna start my own taxi company here in Brookhaven. So first of all, we are gonna need like a taxi spot, like a taxi hub for all the taxis to be parked at and where we can basically have our office. So there we go. I think the warehouse is going to be fine. And of course, we're gonna need our taxi. So let's gonna get our taxi spawn in and then we should be ready for today. And I am gonna need my phone and also let's gonna equip the taxi job and then we're open for business, guys. There we go. Boom, I'm ready for call. So let's gonna get started, man. And we can turn on the lights because that means we are available and dude i'm already actually getting a call let's gonna head over to the caller and it seems like it's coming from far 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 away okay i guess we gotta head over to the caller though and let's gonna turn off the taxi light because now we're not available anymore we're gonna head over to this call right here and see who is calling and hopefully i'll make a ton of money from this call and basically the goal for today is going to make a successful taxi company here in brookhaven hopefully i'll be getting a lot of workers who can help me out and do different missions and yeah Yo, dude, I think a police car has broken down here. Yo, man, this is like crazy. What happened here? To the police station, please. Yeah, hop in, dude. Holy cow, dude. That's not good at all. So let's go drive Mr. Police Officer here over to the police station. His car has been going through it, it seems like. Yo, bro. Okay, nice. And should we give this dude a free ride because he's a police officer? Or should we maybe collect our payments? I think we do need to collect our payments, though. Even though I want to be nice to be a police officer but I'm trying to start a successful company here. So we're gonna need all the profits we can take. Okay, officer, that's gonna be 50 bucks. Thank you very much. Okay, Mr. Police Officer just paid me and I got my $50. Sweet, dude. Okay, now we can actually go ahead and turn on the taxi available sign and keep on cruising around and see if we can go ahead and find some customers. I don't know, dude. I think I'm just gonna see if we do got any people standing around here. If no people are standing around, I'm just gonna finish up customizing my taxi place until we get another call. So let's go ahead and tie in sours taxi company there we go i think that's gonna be pretty sweet let's gonna have that in red and let's gonna make the building yellow okay there we go sours taxi company perfect and dude i'm already getting a call what all righty let's gonna turn off the taxi available sign oh yo dude <laughs> Just flip the taxi, bro. I'm so stupid. Uh-oh, who gave me a driver's license? That's so stupid, man. I'm not really sure how I even passed the driver's test, but yeah, let's go head over to this caller. It seems like it's kind of coming from behind the summer camp. And no way, dude. Is it actually coming from that island back there? Yo, man, what's going on here? I don't know what to do about that, dude. I guess I will have to get a boat and drive over there and i guess we gotta get this boat because this boat actually looks like a taxi so let's gonna take this boat over to that island right there and pick up this customer right here and bro why has he put out lights like that is this a party island or what i don't know dude let's gonna park the boat on the side of the beach here and yeah let's gonna see where this dude is going where are you going to sir i kind of need to know your destination my man so yeah i'm actually curious of where this guy is going and why is he on an island all alone you're anywhere but this island i'm tired of being on it okay you got it sir you got it so he's super super tired of being on the island and yeah let's gonna bring him on land and i guess we could just drive him into the city and hopefully anywhere inside of the city is good enough for him so let's gonna get him inside of the car boom there we go and yo bro i'm actually getting another call so let's gonna drop this guy off by the airport real quick i'm guessing and then we can go ahead and yeah keep on going and you know what? Let's just go ahead and drop him off here. Okay, sir, that's gonna cost you $199. $199. There we go. There we go. We got our payment. And let's go head over to the next caller. And it's coming from this neighborhood right here. Bro, what a busy day, man. I kind of like it, though. So there we go. We just parked outside of the house. Hello there, ma'am. You called a taxi. Hop on in. Hop on in. Where are you going to, ma'am? And yo, dude, I see a competitive taxi. Dude, is that another taxi that's trying to steal business away from me? I don't know. And dude, she's talking a language I don't really understand. Uh-oh. I don't understand ma'am hello do you like talk english because i only speak english dude and you're talking like french or something like that so please speak english ma'am i don't understand you and i actually want to drive you to wherever you want to go i want to be like a good taxi driver and yo there are the two people inside of the taxi talking another language how did the other person get inside of the taxi i'm like so 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 confused right now dude what's going on here okay anyways can i get like 50 bucks dude she's taking off she didn't even pay me and now i'm getting another call okay so another person person is calling me from the Rockstar clothing shop right here. I need a taxi. Yeah, hop on in, hop on in, hop on in. Where you got a taxi right on outside here. So yeah, uh, let's go to see. To the farm. 
down. Okay, so it seems like this person is going over to the farm. So let's gonna take her over to the farm. And the other customer didn't even pay me, dude. Luckily, I do know where the person who didn't pay me lives. So we can maybe even rob her house just to get our payment. Because you know what? Uh, you can't really take a taxi ride. Pretend that you don't understand English. And then you just run away from the bill. Like, that's so, so, so rude. Anyways, we have a ride over by the farm. And how much money should we charge? Like, 100 bucks? Okay, that's gonna be $100. Perfect. And I just got my payment. Nice. And we still got somebody sitting inside of my taxi. Not really sure who this person is. And she doesn't even want to jump out of my taxi. Which is kind of strange. Like, why won't you jump out? I don't know, but I don't even care. Uh, let's go head over to this house, though. This is the house that the girl, uh, that didn't pay me lives in. So, yeah. I'm basically just gonna break in here and collect my money. Rightfully so, dude. You can't accept a taxi ride and not pay for it. So, yeah. Let's go ahead and just break into the house. Hopefully, I won't get caught by a police officer or anything like that. I'm just trying to get my money, you know? There we go. Okay. <laughs> dude, we just blew up the safe. Sweet. It says the security system has detected me, which is not good at all. So, we should probably go ahead and get out of this house before I get busted. Did. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, I wasn't even supposed to do like this, man. Oh, dude, I'm getting a call. And dude, she just arrived home. <laughs> no way, she's outside now. Uh oh, oh, let's gonna take off. Let's gonna take off, dude, before she calls the cops. And I'm getting another call, and it seems like it's coming from over by the town hall here. So let's gonna park the taxi outside of the town hall. We are parked out on the street here, so I'm just gonna turn on the blinkers. And do we gotta go in here and greet the customer? Hello? Oh, man, is this the mayor of Brookhaven? I think this is actually the mayor of Brookhaven, dude. He's wearing a fancy suit. I want to see all of Brookhaven. Yeah, you got it, sir. Okay, so this person wants to see all of Brookhaven. I got my suspicions that this might be the mayor of Brookhaven because he was calling from the town hall. He's wearing a pretty fancy suit. I don't know. And he wants to see the entire city of Brookhaven. So I was gonna drive up the mountain first. This is like the perfect spot to get a good overview of the city. I'm the mayor and I need to see how Brookhaven is doing. Yeah, I kind of understood that, man. Okay, Okay, so this is gonna be the first button. No! Yo! Ah! Yeah, sorry, boss. I just crashed. I was gonna show you the mountaintop of Brookhaven, but I kind of messed it up, dude. Okay, so this is gonna be the first stop, though, since I messed up the mountaintop. This is the camping ground. Pretty sweet place for camping. And now, not too bad, not too bad. And should I show him the summer camp next? Yeah, let's gonna show Mr. Mayor the summer camp. Hopefully, it's up to standards, you know? I don't know. I think the summer camp is a pretty sweet little spot. So, this is the summer camp, Mr. Mayor. Do you recognize it? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, man. Okay, let's gonna take him through the city now. Get me back to the mayor's office quickly. There's an emergency. Oh, man. Okay, so there seems to be an emergency and I need to bring Mr. Mayor over to the mayor's office. So let's gonna bring him over to the mayor's office. Luckily, we're kind of close. So there we go. Now we're outside of the mayor's office. I don't know what the emergency is. Does he want me to help out or should I just wait in the car? Dude, what, should I get my payment? And dude, it doesn't seem like Mr. Mayor is coming out. Dude, did I just get scammed by Mr. Mayor? And bro, who is the police officer in my car? Yo! Oh, dude, no way. Have I gotten reported for the, uh, yeah, for the house theft? Uh-oh, uh-oh, dude, I got plenty of people in my car now. I don't know what's going on, dude. Owning a taxi company here in Brooklyn is so, so, so stressful. Anyways, I'm getting a call from over by the motel, so let's go head over to the motel and see what's going on. Okay, I do see the guy that is calling me. He's just kind of standing on the outside here. So let's go to park on the outside and pick up the passenger. Where to, sir? And dude, this girl is talking French again. I don't understand French. To the ocean. Okay, so the dude I just picked up from the motel wants to go over to the ocean. Fine, dude. I can bring you over to the ocean. No problem, dude. So let's gonna bring Mr. Motel Guy over to the ocean. I don't know what he's gonna do over here by the ocean, but it's really not my business. I'm just gonna take him over to the ocean and get my payment. 50 bucks, sir. It's gonna cost you $50. Perfect. I just got my payment and I don't really know where the guys in my taxi now is going. Why are there two other people in my taxi now? Dude, this is like so confusing. Can people stop like being in my taxi. I didn't really consent to people just sitting inside of my taxi like this. Dude, dude, I just just using my taxi to just warm up, just to have, a, like, a place to stay. I don't know, man, but you know what? I'm actually going to be hiring for my taxi company. So, I was gonna put out a sign that's gonna say, what should it say, dude? Taxi drivers for hire, maybe? Yeah, let's gonna type in a sign real quick. Hiring taxi drivers. There we go, because I'm actually looking for taxi drivers to help me out with my company because the days are like super stressful. I'm getting 
calls from all over the place. So I really want people to help me out. You guys see that? I'm getting yet another call, dude. It's actually so insane. But yeah, it's epic though. I'm making a ton of money, so I shouldn't really complain. Like I've had worse days here in Brookhaven. So yeah, we got a guy chilling here and it seems like it's a doctor who's just standing alone. To the hospital. Yeah, hop on in, doc. Hop on in. I can give you a special ride over to the hospital real quick. Okay, so we got a doctor. Hopefully it won't pay me in apples. Because I got a bad history with doctors here in Brookhaven, is that they won't ever pay me with cash. They always just give me like bananas or apples. And dude, I'm getting yet another call. Dude, this is so insane. 50 bucks, doc. 50 bucks. Hopefully you got the money, dude. Yo, dude, did it just give me a water bottle? Yo, man, pay me with cash, dude. Some water. It's good for you. Man, dude, doctors are trash. They always just pay with apples and water, man. Come on, dude. Just give me money, man. Like, I can buy my own apples. Anyways, I'm getting a call, dude. This is the French girl. She doesn't even talk English, but I guess I will have to pick her up and I was gonna head over to the next caller and it's from inside of this house. Oh, man, what a busy day. Hey, dude. Okay, so let's gonna pick up this customer. Is she standing on the outside or inside? I don't know, man. You called the taxi. Hop out in. Okay, where are you guys going to? I literally just picked up two people. Two people called me at the same time. I definitely need some people to help me out with this taxi business. <laughs> I guess that's the cinema, dude. It's going to be the movie theater, which is going to be located at the mall. So let's gonna head over to the mall then. Club Brooks. Okay, that's gonna cost you $20. So let's gonna drop her off by the mall first, collect our money, and then I'm heading over to Club Brooks. Okay, Club Brooks is going to be next. I just got my payment. Okay, so let's gonna collect our payment and let's gonna go back inside of the taxi and drive this girl over to Club Brooks. Man, what a busy day. And yo, did he just bought his car up on my taxi? Yo, dude. Okay, so here we go. Here's Club Brooks. Let's gonna collect our payment too. Okay, ma'am. That's gonna be 30 bucks. It's not a free ride. Not a free ride, ma'am. And dude, I'm actually getting my payment. Sweet. Thanks. I appreciate that. I appreciate your business. And dude, I'm getting another call. Yo, this is actually such a crazy day. And where's this call coming from? I don't know, man. It seems like it's coming from under the bridge. Yo, dude, who's calling me from under the bridge? Bro, is this a homeless dude? Yo, man, what's going on here? To a beautiful house, please. Oh. Okay, I can take you to a beautiful house. So I'm not really sure. Does this guy live in a beautiful house or is he gonna break into a beautiful house? I don't know, dude. I don't really want to be like involved in crime, but I don't really want it, want him to like hurt me or anything like that because he's homeless, dude. Maybe it's like crazy in the head. So let's gonna bring him over to a beautiful house. I think this house is beautiful. I will get you your money. Yo, dude, what? He's saying he will get me my money, dude. Oh, dude, he just got bad. <laughs> No way, dude. The homeless dude just got banned. That's hilarious, dude. Okay, so he said he was getting me my money, but it just got banned instead. And now I'm getting a call from another spot, dude. This is going to be from over by the mall. I think it's the same girl as earlier on. Yeah, it definitely is, dude. So let's go and get our taxi parked up here and pick her up. I'm not really sure where she's going, though. So yeah, man, where are you going to? And holy cow, this got to be like the most busy day. <laughs> Fountain. So I guess that's a fountain and the fountain is right here, dude So that wasn't really like a long ride. Okay, man That's gonna be ten bucks ten bucks and dude She knows that she actually has to pay which is kind of nice. Thank you. Thank you I appreciate that and we do got another caller on the other side of the street Let's gonna pick her up too. Where to man? Where are we going to and yo dude? I'm getting another call. This is gotta be like the craziest day ever So yeah, let's gonna figure out where this girl is going to drop her off and then we can head over to the next call If she's going home, this is basically clear her home, right? So yeah, dude, I actually got it right. Okay, ma'am, that's gonna be $10, and let's gonna collect our payment. Okay, you have a good day, you have a good day. And now let's gonna head over to the next caller. Bro, that's like three calls, like, so close to each other, man. Like, dude, I am getting, like, overworked here, bro. Oh, <laughs> dude, this gotta be, like, the weirdest day ever. And, bro, why can't I drive up? Dude, my text was bugging out. Hey, sir, where are you going to? Clothing store. Yep, sure, let's gonna bring him over to the clothing store. Alrighty, so this has been quite a long day. Anyways, we're bringing this uh, gentleman over to the clothing store real quick. And there we go. Rockstar Clothing Shop. This is the best clothing store you got in our brocade. So this is a pretty sweet spot. 50 bucks, sir. There we go. Let's gonna collect our payment. And boom, man. And I gotta say, I think I just started the most successful taxi company here in Brookhaven. And look at that, dude. I think I actually got an employee. Yo. Yo, get a taxi. You're gonna drive for my company, ma'am. Is that fine with you? And dude, I'm actually getting yet another call. Okay, so we 
do got a taxi driver just standing here and I'm getting another call So I guess I'm just going to be heading over to the new call that I'm getting and it seems like it's coming from the city here Oh, man. Okay. So yeah, we got the French lady again. I guess yeah, where are you going to mr. French lady? I, I don't really know man Hopefully she will say something that I can understand. I don't really know though Okay, so she's saying something with house 15. I was gonna try and look at house 15 I think it's going to be on the other side of the city. So yeah, let's gonna drive over to the other side of the city to house 15 real quick for this french lady right here where is house 15 that's 11 that's 16 so house 15 should be around here right this is house 15 okay ma'am that's gonna be like 40 dollars 40 dollars in total and boom we just got our payment sweet thank you very much i appreciate that and dude people have been calling the taxi business today like crazy it's been a while since being a taxi driver here in brookhaven was like this successful but yeah i did actually get the uh, taxi driver that was gonna work for me so let's go to have a chat with the new taxi driver hello there start doing taxi runs please and get the taxi job and a phone so people can actually call you and look at that this person actually got the hat and everything that's really really nice so i think i'm actually getting a pretty solid employee right here which is really really good maybe i will just uh, be able to rest for the rest of today because i've been working overtime dude and hopefully she will take care of some of the business so yeah guys that's gonna be it for today's episode hopefully you enjoyed this one and if you did make sure to hit that like subscribe button and i'll see you guys in the next one peace